Hi, it's Dr. Rucker here again. I have a very interesting patient I worked with today and I thought it would be beneficial for my viewing audience to hear about this patient. The subject of treatment today is ozone. I have learned many techniques and observed different practitioners. One of the practitioners who also has posted nice videos dealing with prostate conditions is Dr. Dr. Robert Rowan. Dr. Rowan, I believe, practices in California, and I personally learned a lot of ozone techniques from him at one point in time many years ago in San Diego. I have a unique training background that allows me to have a special viewpoint and special insight on treating prostate diseases. I trained in urologic surgery at Cornell in Manhattan, and I also obtained my medical degree at the University of Virginia. So. We had a strong urology program. I practiced conventional urology for 12 years as a board certified urologist. I presently practice holistic alternative complementary medicine and one of my strong tools that I utilize is ozone therapy. So if you look at one of my previous videos, we published that video approximately December or January 20. Uh, 2017 or slash 2018 January. This video pertained to treating benign prostatic hyperplasia, erectile dysfunction, and prostate cancer. So today I had the opportunity to treat one of my fine patients who's a very nice kind gentleman who was diagnosed with prostate cancer three years ago. Instead of having treatment because he's 70 years old, he opted for what's called watchful waiting. But instead of the classic watch and wait and do nothing program, program, he is eating a very clean prostate cancer healthy diet. He's drinking daily ozonated water and then he has initiated a program of intravenous therapy with us using IV ozone, IV vitamin C, Myers cocktail. So he viewed the videos by Dr. Rowan and what these videos revealed is patients who were treated for prostate cancer had injections of ozone done around their prostate, not into it, bathing the prostate with ozone. And they had excellent results with stabilizing of PSAs, diminishment if not eradication of cancer, resolution of BPH, which is benign prostatic hyperplasia. I've already seen BPH improvements in some of my patients using this protocol. So today was great because I injected one one uh, fluid that helps resolve cancers, it was discovered in Italy. I'll leave it a mystery because if you want to know what it is, you can come in and meet us. But I injected a certain fluid, I injected a numbing agent, and then I injected ozone. And it's basically a sandwich protocol therapy that I've created where I sandwich the prostate with ozone. And it has a lot to do with my understanding of the prostate anatomy as a urologist. So I don't think anyone's doing this exact technique, and we did it on our patient today with an ultrasound used to visualize the anatomy of the prostate and also to ensure that I didn't place a needle into the prostate. I'm not trying to inject into the prostate. So we did that today. I will keep you updated on this patient, but I was really excited to share the, that we did our first patient with this novel technique and the novel substances that I'm using, and we will keep you updated on the patient's progress. But Anyone out there that's, that would like to have a urologic expert that understands anatomy and also understands ozone and complementary, complementary therapies, this is why we're here. Thanks.